going on you guys Volcom0123 here and today I have a match of domination on the map this isn't jungle no um, crisis I'm pretty sure it is yeah all right so I'm on the map crisis and I have the, I'm using the Galil with the silencer and a perk for scavenger side of hand and marathon <laughs> um, earlier today I was trying to get Marathon Pro but the only way to get that is capture the flag and capture the flag for some reason I cannot capture flags because I'll get the flag I'll run back to their spawn or to our spawn and I'll get the I'll get the flag oh, okay obviously I have the flag and I come back to our flag and I'll die right as soon as I'm going to cap it and then somebody flag steals usually some someone of the lower level can't really say noob because I might offend some people, but um, I got to. I, I always get flag stolen, and I never get to really get those thing, those kills, or those cap flag captures. So pretty much what I did was um, uh, I played like four, five, six rounds of capture flags, and I think I only captured three flags. So I was like, get this, I'm just gonna go play domination like I usually do. But yeah, and you can see at the beginning of this match, I really didn't do too good actually. I did die a lot, kind of. Like you can see, I'm getting a lot of hit markers and stuff like that. So right now you can see that I do the boss with extended mags, same perk setup as in all my classes, and I seem to do really good with the FAMAS. I think it's just the rate of fire. That's why I like the gun and the accuracy. Sometimes it does have a lot of recoil, and I can't really use it, but most of the time I can use it because of the power that it has. So another thing I wanted to talk about was the game Black Ops and all the other games pretty much. Now, I don't have a wide selection of games. I have Call of Duty. Let's see. No, I have Call of Duty, all the Call of Duties. Um, okay, Call of Duty. I have... This uh, Black Ops, Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 1, the COD 4, and World at War. Those are the CODs that I have. And then the, I have Godfather 2, Madden. Securing B. I got Halo 3, Halo Reach. Um, so yeah, those are pretty much the games that I like to play for the most part. And I want to hear from you guys. I want to hear what... What kind of games, what kind of game you want me to play, I guess you can say. Because I, I've, on this channel, all I've uploaded so far is Black Ops gameplays. Because I like, I like Black Ops. I like Black Ops a lot because that it's so balanced and I can play it for, I'm still not that bored of it and I'm pretty excited for the new map packs that's going to be coming out. But, what do you, I don't, <laughs> I'm confused because... A lot of people are changing the the games that they're playing. Like a lot of the big commentators, they're all asking the same question. What games do you want to see us playing? Now, I'm not a big commentator, so I kind of want to follow in their footsteps. Not really copy them because I don't really want to do that. But I just want to, I don't want to fall behind because I know a lot of people are watching these big commentators like Xbox, Jaws, Boy, all those big commentators. And they're doing, they're switching up their games a lot. They're playing Portal, Modern Warfare 2, Black Ops, uh, Minecraft. Uh, Minecraft is really big with uh, White Boy. But I just want to hear from you guys. Tell me what you want, and I'll be happy to deliver. I mean, I can't go out and buy, oh, I'm going to go out and buy Homefront, or I'm going to go out and buy Crisis. Um, I can borrow with some friends and get some gameplays with them, but I can't just, I don't have the money to go out and buy them because I'm not, I don't have a job. I guess so yeah just tell me in a message or a comment or something on something that you want because um, I don't want to be left in the dust I guess you say. me being the only one mostly just putting on black ops clips and I guess it might be a good thing too because when the other big commentators are using or playing the playing the other games like Portal, hey, Crisis, secure. and all those kind of games, I'll still be putting up Black Ops gameplays, and if people want to see Black Ops, Black Ops game, gameplays, then just come to me and I'll be happy to, happy to give you 
what you want. If you want the Black Ops in Black Ops Secure, and Modern Warfare position. 2, you can have Modern Warfare 2 if you want COD 4, I can play COD 4 if you want. Even if you want Godfather, I can play Godfather. Or I can even play that little Pac-Man game that is like whatever. I can even play indie games. Now, I don't have a lot of indie games, but I do have... See, what's the most popular game? Everybody has... Oh, I forget the indie game. But I have a couple Coming indie games. But, yeah, like I said, like four times already, just tell me what you want. And I'll be happy to deliver. Now... Um, another thing that I want to happen, or talk about what happened, is this play that's happening in my school. Now, I'm in this theater, at, theater tech class, and pretty much what we do in there is all the tech technical stuff. Like, it's not theater, like, singing or dancing or anything, like, on theater, but it's theater tech, like, what happens behind the scenes. Like, the curtains, the lights, the sound, the... Pretty much everything behind behind the curtains that happens, uh, we're the ones that do it. So I have uh, in the past did direct a play for our school, and I didn't really help. Like I wasn't like big time director, but I did help my teacher to, uh, like build a lot of the stuff and program a lot of the lighting that we did need for that play. So anyway, that's what we do in that class. We just do all the building and stuff. We also do the scenery. But anyway, it is the last nine weeks of our school year, and we are doing a big major project, big class project. And pretty much what we have to do is build this big puppets for some reason. And we have to build everything for the puppets. We have to do all the sound, all the lighting, everything that happens on stage. We have to do all of that. And last class, we were trying to come up with who was going to narrate the whole thing because basically what our story is is a farmer he finds this goose and it lays golden eggs <laughs> I don't know it's a weird story but he the uh, goose lays golden eggs and the farmer tries to sell the eggs and he does and he gets a lot of money and then he cuts open the goose to see where the, if the gold's inside and of course the, the gold's not going to be inside the goose so he becomes poor again Anyway, we have to make puppets of a goose and a farmer, and we're going to be performing it for the special ed kids at our school. Uh, I think it's a cool thing because we get to perform it for them, but we kind of have to like work and make it around for them because we can't really have a murdered goose, goose in front of a special ed kid. So be, I don't know, we want scare them, but anyway, we had to find a narrator. Now... The narrator had to have a clear voice and everything. So we were all Charlie testing out our voices on the mic. And of course, they picked me to be the narrator because I guess I have a clear voice and Charlie stuff. I'm not really floating, but that's what my teacher said. I'm not, ready for deployment. Not, like trying to Security make myself look good or anything because they're not my words. But, and if you haven't guessed, then... <laughs> my little thing that I said on the mic, I did say my intro. Now I didn't say, what is going on you guys? Welcome 0123 here. But I said, what is going on you guys? Aaron here. And well, that's my name. I said it in the video I think I have it, but here's my name. And yeah, so I did that. And pretty much everybody picked me now. It was between me and this other girl. I don't know, but she was pretty good. I think she was better than me. But I am gonna have to narrate this play about the goose and the farmer. And I'm looking forward to it, I guess you could say, but I don't know, I'm it's kind of I kinda of guess get stage fright, although I'm gonna be in the back of the booth working on lights also and doing this. So I don't know how this is all gonna turn out. So I guess I'll I can make a commentary on how the play went. When I did do that, or, or when I do do it, I do do it. So anyway, guys, um, I am getting close to the end of this gameplay, and I hope you liked this kind of gameplay where I talk about kind of like I guess what's happening in my life. And remember to keep, uh, get, give me your ideas that you want, and just give them to me, and I'll try to accommodate your wants and needs. I guess you can say. All right, guys, I'll see you later. Bye.